Hi guys and girls, Gadafrey from 97 here. Welcome to today's video. I'm going to be unboxing and taking an in depth look at Doctor Who The Collection Season 18, uh, Tom Baker's final season on Blu ray. It's quite funny now, actually, how we've kind of got the bookends of Tom Baker's era. So we've got Season 12, which is the first series, and now Season 18. So now, when they kind of release future releases, kind of filling in uh, the missing gaps. But today, uh, I'm going to be looking at the box set. Uh, of course, the artwork's done by the brilliant early binding. Um, I think there's a couple new documentaries on it. Uh, I don't think there's as much uh, new sort of documentary stuff as season 19. You've obviously got the brilliant bit on the sofa. So let's take a look at the box set. So the cover um, obviously with Tom uh, in his season 18 outfit. It's probably one of my favourite Tom Baker outfits to be honest. I really do like it. Um, I know Tom do like it. Obviously it's the start of the kind of little question marks. The monsters we've got underneath. Uh, we've got the Watcher, the Master uh, from the Goplis. Creatures from Argolis, the names <laughs> escape me. We've got the Swamp Creatures from Full Circle and the uh, Master's TARDIS Disguised. Uh, there. You've got Doctor Who Collection Season 18 on the top uh, and obviously you've got it down here. Uh, 8 disc set. Um, it's the same width as the Season 19 one. Obviously got 12 as well. Um, of course obviously you can sort of take this bit out of the slip case which does the same stuff on the sort of panel. Um, you can basically have it without the 12 uh, logo if you wanted to. On the side you've got a picture of Tom uh, just on his own which is a trend for the other box sets just having the Doctor um, with no monsters on it. Um, on the back about the cover um, we have the castle from Warrior's Gate. Um, really awesome uh, artwork. It's like a kind of like painted illustration looks like. Um, we've also got uh, Romana and K9 uh, going in. On the other side got Season 18, uh, the collection, uh, Dot2 logo and all that stuff. Uh, there, looking on the actual back uh, of the slipcase, so we've got a nice picture of Tom. Um, for a thing from Legopolis actually, uh, when he's sitting uh, with Adric, obviously not in the picture, but um, sitting with Adric uh, talking about Gallifrey and the mass and all that stuff in the beginning of Legopolis. Got all the leaves and branches sort of, uh, and all the crumbled uh, arches and all that stuff. Very really nice illustration. Um, so we've got Continue, your Dot 2 archive uh, with the ultimate collector set. Uh, the fourth Doctor, uh, classic final season, uh, all 20 episodes, plus a one-off special, uh, Canine Company, all new restored with Blu-ray and packed with bonus material. And obviously these are all the episodes we've got, so we've got Leisure Hive, Megalos, Full Circle, State of Decay, Warrior's Gate, Keeper Trark and Legopolis, plus Canine and Company. Um, it's really cool they've actually included that. Um, I was wondering if they were going to do it for season 19, but uh, nope, we, we've got it on this one. Let's have a look at the special features this comes with. So we've got new audio commentaries uh, with Tom Baker on the Leisure Hive, uh, Lala Ward on the State of Decay, so that's really nice. Optional updated special effects for Legopolis. Uh, I saw that at the BFI. I don't know if that was the finished, finished version, but um, it's really good. Kind of adds a more epic scale uh, to the final sequence of uh, Legopolis. So yeah, it's a real harder watch, I'd say. <laughs> Obviously, it's Tom's final story, but it's more dramatic. Um, we've got a new Legopolis making of doc documentary the writers room season 18 writers discuss their work i think they just sat in a pub just talking about all the writing stuff which is a, a nice atmosphere to be in a weekend with waterhouse uh toby haddock spends a weekend with matthew waterhouse quite similar to that john levine thing they did uh back on the claws of axos dvd behind the sofa new episodes with tom baker john neeson june hudson who's obviously the costume designer janet fielding sarah sutton and wendy padbury she's a first on these uh, Beyond the Series. I always love the Beyond the Series because even though you've seen the episodes before, it's a nice kind of n blend of commentary and, and watching the episodes. So, uh, rare Beyond the Scenes footage from Legopolis, uh, new and rare archival interviews with Tom Baker, Matthew Waterhouse, and Ian Sees, uh, new 5.1 mixes for Warriors Gate, uh, that's the only story I think they've done, uh, production archive material from the BBC archive. Each disc features extensive special features previously released on DVD, including documentary features, surround sound mixes, audio commentaries, rare footage, production information, subtitles, ISET music scores and much more. You get also all the stuff you get uh, with the standard DVDs. You've got starring Tom Baker, Lala Ward, Matthew Warhouse, Sarah Stern and Janet Fielding. I do all the technical mumbo jumbo uh, talking about <laughs> all the copyright stuff and the sort of specifications of the DVD stuff. So. Let's take a look inside the vault, the archive. Uh, really nice clean cover, obviously, of Lee Bynes' amazing work. Um, nice sort of purple theme. So open this up, 
um, I'm sure it's the same as the other kind of formats. Um, obviously, you've got the sort of window here. Uh, this is really cool. This is obviously from Legopolis when uh, Tom's Doctor turns old for most of the story. Get another great 3D model of the TARDIS. I think there's some space working outs. Uh, on there. Open it up, um, you've obviously got uh, Tom from the back of the cover, again uh, from the God Piss, obviously that opens up, it's kind of like a bit of a jigsaw. It's all open up that the DVDs are trying to pop out as well. Um, of course you've got a great 3D model of the 80s TARDIS and they've actually added the TARDIS inside the TARDIS from the uh, and obviously sort of the, the measuring stuff they use to measure it for the calculation stuff uh, they need for the here is the awesome uh, manual, again the same sort of cover, uh, you've got the Season 18 uh, logo stuff down there. On the back uh, you've got Tom from Season 18, not signed this time, uh, obviously you've got the TARDIS uh, inside the TARDIS again, um, and the nice sort of uh, photo stuff of uh, the inside the TARDIS uh, and the debris. It's the end but the moment has been prepared for. We've got a nice black and white image of Tom. Talking is about the sort of the setup for this season. Uh, we've got the Leisure Hive, all the content on there. A nice uh, kind of Target novelization style artwork. I really do love that. Megalos, a uh, picture with uh, Tom Baker and of course previous companion Jacqueline Hill. Megalos, Tom Baker, <laughs> uh, cactus uh, version. Uh, telling you all about the recording and how the episode was went down. Full Circle, one of my personal favourites. Uh, you've got the Martian creature down there. And obviously, you've got a nice one with Adric, obviously that's his first story and the start of the Eve Space Trilogy. Um, we've got these spiders which attack uh, Lala Ward, uh, State of Decay, all the stuff on that. Warrior's Gate, um, again nice little titanization with K9, obviously his kind of last story for a while. So I think the Five Doctors actually. Um, Keeper Trarkin, obviously got uh, Jeffrey Beaves' master, uh, really like Keeper Trarkin, managed to get one big finish. Um, we've got the Keeper Trarkin there, uh, Aunt Fanny's character, obviously uh, Nissa's dad, obviously this is Nissa's first as well. Quite weird how kind of all the Fifth Doctor companions were introduced in uh, Tom's final series. They're kind of used as a kind of um, kind of backdoor for, for season 19. Uh, and of course you've got Logopolis, um, you've got the Watcher there, looks like he's about to give us the middle finger. Another uh, great piece of artwork, um, miniaturised TARDIS as well. Yeah, it's really in-depth really, you've got the box set. Um, obviously k and Company, uh, I don't know if there's no special feature stuff for that, obviously apart from behind the sofa. There's the bonus material, uh, it's got the writer's room, the fourth doctor revisited fifth anniversary documentary uh 23 interview with matthew waterhouse at the dot 250 convention uh Panoptican Archive, Commercial Break, Season 18 Blu-ray Trailer, which is that really funny one, I think, uh, and the Studio Clock. So yeah, uh, really great stuff, uh, really nice, informative. Of course, I would read of that stuff, because a lot of sort of written stuff has been put into that. Kind of gives sort of a nice uh, written pieces on all the episodes. So... The discs have been trying to get out for quite a while. <laughs> Finally, let's take a look at the discs. First up, we've got the Leisure Hive, uh, obviously featuring Tom when he's in that kind of bubble and gets turns the old man and uh, one of the Logopolis uh, people. Uh, we've got Megalos, features Lala Ward, and the Cactus Blank. <laughs> it's that weird, like, <laughs> sort of modern day guy who just gets filming the story. And of course, we've got Jack and Hill. Nice to have her on uh, the cover. Uh, full Circle, uh, No Marsh Men. Just a fourth Doctor in Karen looking at the Marsh Men from the part one cliffhanger of that story, State of Decay. Looks like a nice picture of them uh, from the forest and the tireless in the background. Warrior's Gate, very trippy story. I think I've watched it once, I think. That's a bit of those stories you think, what is going on? But you kind of just have to enjoy it. Uh, so yeah, very nice uh, stuff on that. Cupid Traken, Logopolis, one final stand with Tom Baker. Um, really, really sad image of him just looking like, oh, guess I've got to go then. And of course, the final disc is K9 and Company, which actually has the bonus features on it as well. Uh, so yeah, really, really nice uh, disc arts. Really love the purple kind of themed disc styles uh, for this set, which I think, to be honest, this box that has the most in individuality I guess. Uh, I think it stands out the most colour wise. Obviously it kind of uses that purple theme to set it out from the others I think. It has that more sort of tonal kind of thing. I know obviously the season 19 was a bit of a blue theme cover but I feel this is like better defined. So if you enjoyed um, the unboxing video uh, please comment like and subscribe and follow me on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, links to that stuff in the description below. If you've got your copy of the season 18 box set yet uh, are you pleased with it? Uh, let me know in the comment section below all your thoughts on the new set. Uh, I'll be doing a season 18 uh, classic trailer that should be out sort of next week hopefully. Uh, got a few Dot 2 stuff as well got a series of them ranking coming soon as well and also a few Marvel videos or sort of stuff for the new trailer uh, and a review of Captain Marvel. Keep your eye on the channel uh, for new content 
uh, coming soon. So as always, guys and girls, thank you very much for watching. And I'll go off and uh, binge watch this box. <laughs> uh, that's my sort of plan for the weekend now. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye!